Hello, my name is Sean and welcome back to Intramural Sports. As you know, we do a lot to promote intramural sports in the rec department, but many of you don't know that we have an intramural reporter. It's a bi-weekly newsletter that we push out. I'm here with the editor and writer of that, uh, Caleb Janowski. Caleb, can you tell me a little bit about the Intramural Reporter so students know about it? Well, the Intramural Reporter uh, gives me a chance to explain to all of you guys out there what's going on in Intramural Sports. We have, as far as a bi-weekly calendar, um, we have a, all of our officials of the week. We give a little spotlights on the championship teams, and then I write some articles myself. Tell me a little bit about that bi-weekly calendar. What's, what all is included in that? Well, the calendar basically gives the students who are reading the Intramural Reporter uh, a chance to look at what's coming up in, in, in Intramural Sports. Um, there's a two-week calendar where we color coordinate all everything from captain's meetings to entries when they're due. Very cool. Now, I know all the sport coordinators put out rankings. Um, are those rankings included in the Intramural Reporter? Well, for our winter sports, we will start including rankings. Uh, it's kind of cool to be able to see your own team name up at the number one spot or the number three spot. And when that way, when you're playing the number two, three team, you're looking to upset and possibly knock them out of the rankings. So even when your season isn't looking like you're going to the playoffs, you still got a chance to be uh, that upset team. So it's pretty cool to see. That's awesome. Now, I also know that we have a lot of um like giveaways in rec sports. Uh, do you promote those on the Intramural Reporter or do you, you know, do you put a lot of information in there on them? Oh yeah, we, uh, we, ha well, we have everything from dodgeball tournaments which are free. Um, we have a couple other tournaments which are free and then we have our Twitter Trivia of the Month which uh, as long as you subscribe to our Twitter channel and we promote that on Facebook as well. Uh, it's a good opportunity to get yourself an Intramural t-shirt without necessarily being in an Intramural sport. Well thanks for your time Caleb, really appreciate it. If the intramural reporter sounds something interesting to you, feel free to check it out. We have it in two places. We have it printed out and tacked to our poster board outside of Room 100, as well as on our website. Just click the newsletter link and you can print it out at your leisure. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, UWW Intramurals, and keep up on all our happening. As for me, Dan and Caleb, we'll see you next time.